there is power at the altar, the authority we need to solve our problems is at the altar. It doesn't have to be an altar of marble or carved wood, just an altar as simple as the chair in front of which you kneel, your bedside, your car seat, the street corner, the kitchen sink, anywhere, find an altar. I want to pray with you. Heavenly Father, it is so blessed to be thy child and to experience thy love and care. We place our complete trust in your character and intentions as our Father. We bless thy holy name. Thy name, Jesus, is a strong tower into which we run and are safe. Because thy name is the authority of thy kingdom, we are calling upon thy name. We need you, Jesus. We really need you. Some of us are numbed by grief. Others are paralyzed by gnawing, tormenting fear. And then there are those who are living in constant pain while others are haunted by a sordid past. So let thy kingdom come. Jesus, when you walked on earth, you demonstrated the nature of thy kingdom's government. You healed the sick, delivered the oppressed, and even raised the dead. Lord, let thy kingdom come. That that you demonstrated on earth, let it come to us as a people called by thy name. We seek thy holy will, so give us this day our daily bread, for our life is totally dependent upon you. O oh Lord, we trust in thee as we live from hand to mouth, from your hand to our mouth. And as we come to thy altar, we come forgiving others as we are now being forgiven. Give us a pure heart so we need not be tested. Keep us from every wrong turn. Lead us into all righteousness and give us the knowledge that our lives are being channeled into thy eternal purpose and divine approval, making us a blessing to others 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 and now we want to thank thee for revival for revival is everywhere and it is a good day to be alive in jesus name we pray and everybody said amen